Alright guys, just one thing I want to say before the video starts is that I want to ask a question for you guys. Comment down below what you think of this. I've been doing in the past these live walkthroughs um, where I play through a story game or just a game in general and I live stream it. And we do about two hours. Um, it's usually uploaded or streamed in between each video. And I've got a game that I want to do called days gone um i'm not sure if i should do it but comment down below if you'd like to see a days gone live stream walkthrough where we stream two hours every two days the thing is is that i'll still upload a video on the day that i do this live stream but just comment down below if you're interested in seeing this because i would like to hear some feedback of the idea of me doing this again because i enjoyed doing it but for my channel growth I want to know if um, you guys are actually interested in this idea of mine. Uh, yeah, comment down below if you want to see a Days Gone live stream walkthrough. We'll be streamed every two days or two hours. Video uploaded on the same day of MLB The Show 19. But yeah, guys, comment down below what you think. Alright, hello everybody. Welcome back to another MLB The Show 19 video. Today we are back with some Battle Royale. I did draft a team um, in my last Battle Royale video, but I ended up playing it because fourth inning came out and I needed wins for the 30 stars. So I went ahead and just played BR because there was no event going. I ended up going like, I think five and one with that, five and two with that team technically. So that's how it ended. And then I did another draft. Yeah, all that on and on. But uh, yeah, we're just going to draft today. Honestly, I wasn't a fan of that team the only thing i really liked was ricky but I, I i have ricky on my main squad now anyway so it's not that big of a deal so i'm hoping that i can maybe play with like willie mccovey or something somebody i haven't really played with 99 yadier molina 98 he's a 98 i thought he was a 99 we are for sure taking yadi uh, i do have alomar on my team i played with him before 13 at bats i want to use somebody new so we're going with yadi there we go all right We'll take uh, we'll take a starter get rid of that right away Matt Bush Ioannis Suspedis I'm gonna take Matt Bush he's pretty filthy actually and then we'll take another reliever Gossage Alan Trammell or Andre Dawson I haven't gotten to use Andre Dawson either let's put him on the team I'm curious he seems like a card who rakes. Hector Neris, Robin Yo, Trey Turner. I am pretty good with Trey Turner. Like any Trey Turner card, I'm pretty solid with. So I could go with that, but this Hector Neris would be a pretty go solid guy to have to the pen. But no, we're going to go with Trey Turner for sure. Um, Alberto Montesi has a glitch swing. Archie Bradley. Max Adams, I do great with. I'm going to put him on the team. Oliver Prez, for sure. He's got 5.4 ERA right now, but lately, in, like, this guy's filthy and all. But, like, in ev we need a lefty, and in every other account, this guy's been great for me. So, I'm going to use him. Drew Smiley. All right, we'll do him, too. Uh, we'll do Keon Killa, just because I didn't really like any of those guys. Michael Chavis, he has some decent stats for a bronze. Might go with him. That's actually really good for a bronze card. But our pen is pretty stacked now. Two righties are good, two lefties are good. That's really all we need. So I'll go with Scott Barlow, why not? Michael Franco, he's got a bad inside edge. Waste on the starter. David Boat, Corey Dickerson. Ryan Dozier is kind of good. Who's got the highest vision? Corey Dickerson, but not by much. Yeah, I'll go Brian Dozier at second base. Damn, Chessie's a silver now? So is David Freeze. But only 48 vision. That is rough. I'll use him anyway. He seems good. Uh, here, I might waste another starter. Yeah, I'm going to do that because, yeah, look, we would have had to waste it on a silver instead. 
Okay, Domingo Santana does rake, but 31 vision, man. Again, too low. Trey Mancini. I'm not good with him on the on my main account either. Wow, okay. I'm good with him on every other account. Strange. Seem to have that trend on this account. You're fast, but you have zero stealing, so you'll never steal a bag. You have 56 speed and have decent hitting stats. Pinch runner, but not for stealing. Ugh. Guess another one. Matt Olson, damn, alright, he's a pretty solid one. First and left. I mean, at this point, it is just improvements, although this card kind of rakes. Second base, we have Dozier. Could get another lefty in there. Austin Jackson ain't bad either. Roger Swornsby. I use this Matt Olson. I'm four for twelve with a home run. First and right. So we would have to move Andre Dawson probably out of his position, or take out Matt Adams. But I don't really want to do that. I'd probably take out Mancini because he has a bad inside edge. He's got 48 vision. He's got 65. Better all around fielding. Yeah, I'll take him for Brian Dozier. Alright, this guy can somewhat steal. Alright, so move him at second. Second and shortstop? Who's that shortstop? Out of Bruno. Yeah, no. You're not playing over him. Uh, this is what the... Okay, he's gonna... So he's gonna be our main pinch hitter. We got Oliver Perez and Drew Smiley for our lefties. We got Keon Kella, Archie Bradley, and Matt Bush for our righties. Because those guys are pretty useful. This guy's a bad inside edge, but normally probably usable Scarbrello can be usable so I'll take him too and we got Yachty too man oh we got oh, nice I like him I like him and then we got Trey Turner and Andre Dawson Trey Turner has 73 vision you have 79 Yachty has 114 vision wow is he gonna be our leadoff hitter Um, he, mm, he might be. I'll have him as my third man. Yeah, you know what? Sure. Let's do it. Then Rugnet Odor right there. Adalberto Modesty. Trey Turner. Matt Adams. David Fries and Trey Mancini. Alright, I like how the lineup looks. We got, we're going to play one game because we drafted our team this video. So let's get into one game and then we'll play two in the next. We're facing the Toronto Wizards. What's he got? He's got Player of the Month Cody Bellinger, Signature Series Willie McCovey, Dante Bichette, Didi, and Roberto Alomar. So he's got somebody in his pen too. That's actually a hell of a lineup. That's a nice lineup. Rafael Devers, Malik Smith. It's a pretty good lineup right there. What's your record there, bud? You are 34 and 7. I'm 34 and 9. Oh, okay. So we're pretty damn close. I'm going to get Matt Bush and Drew Smiley ready right away. Going to get the best guys ready. All right, Yaddy. Okay, first pitch taken for a ball. All right. I'm debating if I'm going to power swing. Let's do it. Yeah, and that's what happens. No power swing after that. Nope. What? Yadi strikes out from a check swing. That was a check swing. No way. He did not take his bat off his shoulders. Well, I mean, he didn't break the plate. He didn't break the plate is what I'm saying. Jose Leclerc, all right. Like that's even worse than Yachty's. I don't, I don't understand. Rugnet Odor. Looks like he's just gonna hit a deep fly ball. All right. I like, I like to get my, I like to get a run in the first inning. So hopefully, Hopefully Andre Dawson can come up here. He's better against righties anyway. Oh my god. It's just too early on it.
Andre Dawson. That might be a home run. Oh my god. Ball died at the warning track. All right. Let's get the pen ready. Oh, pen's already ready. What am I saying? Uh, let's pitch a curve. Why is it impossible to for me not to allow leadoff home run in BR? Like, perfect release with a curveball, and that's where it ends up. Yeah, well, of course he's going to hit a bum because you're literally just forcing me to hang a pitch. Nothing I could do about that. I did everything in my power to pitch that correctly, and I did it correctly. Away cutter. Popped him up. One run is already scored. Oh, it sucks. It sucks. I do not want to go on one. That really shows I got to change something if I end up going on one. Oh my god, I don't know what is going on. I feel like it's not even me. Like, that changeup didn't go anywhere where it was supposed to. Alright, second out. Just these small little things, you know? They can really ruin the game. Alright, DD's up. Let's do another weight cutter. Worked the first time. Let's see if it works the second. He's still late on it. It's actually kind of weird that he's late on it. Usually you're early. Unless you're sitting on it. That is such an awkward hit. But at the same time, it was a nice one. It was awkward, but it was nice. Just because, like, the shift was there, but it just didn't work. Because, like, that's a good good on a low. Oh, my God. That's gross. All right. Deep fly. Or not deep fly ball. Fly out. And the first. We're down by one. Score. One. Arboro Modesty up. Adelberto Modesty crushes that ball to right field. Not for a home run, though. Just short. That's as close as I'll ever get to hitting a home run without hitting one. I'm actually pretty good with any Trey Turner card, so I'm hoping that he comes through here. Yep. You need to get to third. not going to send him home. I'm going to keep him at third because there is nobody out. There is no need to send him home. Not when I still got like someone like Matt Adams coming up. Even if he brings out a lefty, we'll be fine. He's going to intentionally walk Matt Adams. Who's coming up? David Free. Spoos against righties though. Yep, he gets a hit. That's going to... Uh, yeah, I'm holding him. Again, not challenging when I don't need to. Alright, Trey Mancini's up. Oh, wait. That's landing. Get him running. Oh, okay, it's over the wall. Alright, let's get Brian Dozier out. Oh, okay, he's gone. <laughs> Alright, he's gone, he's out. Yeah, that's what happens. You score a few runs and they're out of here. All right, guys. As you can see, we're at 285 stars. We'll be having a little bit of a pack opening when we get to 300, and we'll be picking our boy. Just, just gonna tell you that now. But uh, yeah, guys. If you enjoyed the video, hit thumbs up button. If you did, subscribe more content like this. As always, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.